Our topic is design of analog to digital converter using CMOS logic. The biggest advantage in digital circuits and digital signals as compared to analog circuits and analog signals is the processing speed and efficient transmission. The comparator is the most important component in the ADC architecture. In flash ADC, it is possible to achieve higher speed, linearity, accuracy, and higher resolution. Furthermore, the battery encoder can be used to develop the speed of flash ADC. Introduction The minimum channel length of the transistor will be trans scaled down to 0.065 micrometer in 2007 according to the roadmap of semiconductors. In addition to this downscaling, today's sem system on chip trend forces analog and digital integrated ICs to be integrated on a single chip called the complete SOC. ADCs for the complete SOC are high speed conversion. Low power dissipation and low power, opera low power operation. In terms of higher speed conversion, 0.13 micrometer CMOS technology presently allows processor speed in excess of 2.4 GHz. However, the sampling of ATC is fabricated with an advanced process has been around 200 mega samples per second to remove the spe speed gap between a processor and an ADC in the complete SOC implementation and ADC architecture must not only be fast but also cheap another challenge is low power dissipation the downscaling of the minimum channel length to 0.065 micrometer results in the re reduction of the power supply voltage to 0.7 volt as a result an adc should be operated in a small voltage range the post system threshold inverter quantization flash adc we propose a high speed cmos flash analog to digital converter architecture with low power dissipation which features the threshold inverter quantization technique the main advantage of the tiq based cmos flash analog to digital converter is a simpler comparator design the design is to use the idea is to use digital inverters as analog voltage comparators this eliminates the need of for high gain differential input voltage comparators that are inherently more complex and slower and slower than the digital inverters next we can see the block diagram of our tiq flash adc tiq comparator the TAQ comparator compares the ref a reference voltage VRF with input voltage V in and convert V in into 1 or 0. If V in is greater than VRF, the output of the comparator is 0, otherwise uh, the output of comparator is 1, otherwise 0. Commonly used comparator structures in CMOS ADC's design are the fully differential latch comparator and dynamic comparator. The former is sometimes called a clock comparator and the latter is called an auto zero comparator or chopper comparator. To achieve high speed, such comparators are usually are usually implemented with bipolar transistor technology. Second one is gain booster. It uses two cascade CMOS inverters as a comparator for high speed conversion and low power dissipation. The third one is TC to BC encoder. TC means thermometer code and BC means binary code. TC to BC encoder. The thermometer code the thermometer code to binary code encoder typically convert the thermometer code to binary code into two steps after the comparator after the comparators uh, have produced the TC, Zor logic is used to change the TC into one out of n codes. After that, this code is changed to BC top speed uh, the Glimmer ADC. We propose a new TC to BC encoder as a fat tree encoder that is profoundly responsible for high velocity and low power consumption. Third one is newly designed uh, encoder which is fat tree encoder. The uh, to speed up the encoder uh, which is uh, bottleneck in the speed of flash ADC we suggest using a factory encoder the factory encoder outperform other encoders primarily you uh, primarily due to its fast speed fast encoding speed and low power consumption the factory encoder the size differential is zero on account of its pre engineering as a result it runs mu uh, much faster than an encoder of ROM variety for instance uh, in three bit encoding uh, there are only two or gate delays one of the obstacles to enhancing the TIQ flash ADC implementation in the FA, in the factory encoder three dimensional design automation simulation result and discussion the TIQ the TIQ circuit the TIQ circuit um, and experimental finding are discussed here the TIQ flash ADC is were developed using the ADC 2004 A tool and standard CMOS technology at 130 nanometer the HPIC E model has been utilized as a standard library Three short voltage as displayed in figure one the three short voltage of inverter shift with transistor size seven 
the figure 2 dissipated result of a 3 bit TIQ computer simulation the uniformity of 7 equally spaced inverted 3 short voltage is also dissipated in this figure table 1 displays the variety 3 short voltage that we that were obtained for a step size of 0 0.81 0 0.1875 volt and 3 bits figure 2 out uh, figure 2 represent output of a 3 bit TIQ comparator and figure 3 represent output of gain booster of 3 bit Conclusion. The three short inverter condensation technique is the fast, simple and cascade CMOS inverter comparator used in flash ADC architecture. For advanced TIQ flash ADCs, a new type of encoder known as factory encoder has been developed. The TIQ flash ADC is highly is highly suitable for the complete SOC integration using the standard digital CMOS processor due to its high data conversion rate and comparable power consumption. According to the result of simulation tests, the factory encoder was faster than the drone, standard drone type encoder.